हेलो एवरी वन आई वेलकम यू टू आई सी एस महेश पी यू कॉलेज धारवाड यूट्यूब चैनल स्टूडेंट्स वी आर डिस्कसिंग द टॉपिक द सॉलिड स्टेट इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट द पैकिंग एफिशियंसी इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैड अंडरस्टूड पैकिंग एफिशियंसी ऑफ द सिंपल क्यूब टूडे लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड द पैकिंग एफिशियंसी ऑफ फेस सेंटर्ड क्यूबिक यूनिट सेल एंड बॉडी सेंटर्ड क्यूबिक यूनिट सेल लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड द सेकेंड वन पैकिंग एफिशियंसी ऑफ बॉडी सेंटर्ड क्यूबिक यूनिट सेल see this is the diagram of body centered cubic unit cell students what is body centered cubic unit cell it is a type of unit cell in which lattice points are present at the body center along with the lattice point present at the corner from this diagram it is explained that the lattice point present at the point a and f okay that touches the lattice point present at the body center that is c okay and it becomes the body diagonal it is called body diagonal okay in the diagram af is the body diagonal okay let us understand in this arrangement the particles are in touch with one another along the body diagonal okay particles they touch each other along the body diagonal what do you mean by body diagonal it is the diagonal which touches the opposite edges or opposite corners let a be the edge length of the cube and r be the radius of the sphere athwa constituent particle or constituent particle okay let us take a triangle efd a triangle efd it is a right angle triangle efd okay in that fd square which is an hypotenuse will be equal to ef square plus ed square what is fd here fd square okay let us consider it as a b okay the diagonal length is considered as b so therefore it becomes b square which is equal to ef square ef is an edge length therefore a square ed square which is also an edge length that is a square so which will be 2a square and finally b is equal to root 2a next part now in triangle afd in the triangle afd you can look into the diagram in the triangle afd hypotenuse af square equal to ad square plus fd square so af if you consider it as a c af you consider it as a c it will become c square which is equal to ad square ad square will be a square fd square you have obtained previously okay that is root 2a root 2a square will be 2a square so totally the answer is 3a square and finally the c will be equal to root 3a what is c here c is the distance between a and f c is the length of between a and f okay length between a and f okay the length of the body diagonal that is c will be equal to 4r therefore root 3a equal to 4r root 3a equal to 4r that is c equal to root 3a we have obtained root 3a equal to 4r a is equal to 4r by root 3 okay and what is the volume of cube it is the cube of an edge length that is a cube that is uh, 4r by root 3 cube okay since it is a body centered cubic unit cell total number of atom will be 2 and the volume of two atom can be written as 2 into uh, the volume of one atom is 4 by 3 pi r cube so therefore volume of two atom is 2 into 4 by 3 pi r cube 
okay you have to simplify you have to substitute the values in this formula which is equal to volume of two atoms 2 into 4 by 3 pi r cube by volume of the unit cell that is 4 r by root 3 into 100 4 r by root 3 cube into 100 after simplification my dear students finally you are going to get the answer as a 68 percent what is this means this means the packing efficiency in a body centered cubic unit cell is 68 percent then what is an empty space 100 minus 68 that is 32 percent okay let us consider the another one the third one packing efficiency in fcc what is fcc it is a type of unit cell in which lattice point present at the face centers along with it is present at the along with it is present at the corners okay in fcc students look at ac line ac you look at it is called a face diagonal the diagonal formed at the face of a cube is called face diagonal okay so let the unit edge length be what is that unit edge length is a you can see edge length is a and r be the radius of the sphere r is the radius of the sphere okay the phase diagonal that is ac which is called as a b phase diagonal ac which is called as b then what is the value of b it is 4 r you can look into the you can add the radius of each sphere three spheres are there okay so totally the radius will be 4 r okay let us consider in triangle abc students look at the diagram in the triangle abc okay in the triangle abc hypotenuse ac square will be equal to b square that is the hypotenuse ac is hypotenuse that is b therefore b square which is equal to bc square plus ab square both are edge lengths which will be equal to a square plus a square that is 2a square okay b square is equal to 2a square or b is equal to root 2a b is equal to root 2a hypotenuse value we have obtained that is root 2a and also we have known that b is equal to 4r which is equal to root 2a or a is equal to 4r by root 2 you have to remember the value of edge length in all the three cases my dear students which will be equal to 2 root 2r two which will be equal to 2 root 2r two okay so the value of a is 2 root 2r two number of particles per unit cell how many in phase center corner 1 in all the 6 phases 3 that is totally that is 4 total volume of 4 spheres is, is written as 4 into 4 by 3 pi r cube okay that is 16 by 3 pi r cube substitute the value in the formula okay what do you get 16 by 3 pi r cube to the volume of cube that is the value of b okay that is uh, sorry the value of a that is 2 root 2 r okay cube to 100 students after simplification you are going to get okay the value that is 74 percent the packing efficiency of FCC is 74%. Okay. So, what is the empty space? Empty space is 26%, my dear students. So, this is the packing efficiency, my dear students. Among the three, the most efficient way of packing is FCC. Thank you.